Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your October mid-month reading. Check your moon, Venus, and rising if these messages don't resonate or if you'd like more insights. Uh, the competition is still going on until the end of October. Like, subscribe, and comment whether you'd like to win the Arcanum deck or the Gilded Tarot, okay? By, by commenting, you, you've um, automatically entered. So, what's going on with Sagittarius? Sagittarius, mid-month October 2018. King of Wands, overall energy, which is you basically, fire sign. So, some of you are wanting to release a burden, could be a burdening relationship situation. At the same time, the three of um, pentacles as you're feeling, so it could be a third party, or feeling like maybe it's a lot of work, a relationship is a lot of work, or a situation, or wanting to work on a situation with your partner. So you have the devil, that's how you see them. So like wanting to release a burden and seeing them as the devil, it's kind of weird, but Feeling like you're still attached. Some people, some of you may feel like you're still attached to this person. Um, this person has a hold on you, or you may be really comfortable with this person, but things may have gotten too too much, become too much. They. Someone is wanting to turn a blind eye to maybe some cheating third party. It could be them or you. How they feel, the Ace of Wands. So this person still has feelings for you. They still feel like it can work. How they see you is a Ten of, Pent the ten of Cups, sorry. So if you could be married to this person or just in a, in a relationship, but they are seeing things as normal. It's like they don't know that you're going through, you know, wanting to be single or wanting to take a break. They completely, they don't know, or at least maybe they're pretending not to know. It could be vice versa, okay? Page of Pentacles, so there are messages coming in, regardless. There could be kids involved, you know, as I see here. Could be one child or more, or a child and a baby. But this person, they still see the relationship as strong, like they still they don't see anything wrong, or at least they're telling themselves that everything is fine. You may be seeing the issues. Let's see, six of wands, so. It seems like you guys are gonna be getting what you want. If you are, if you are waiting for contact that is coming in, you will be in the six of wands energy. So those of you who are wanting contact that is coming in with the page. But some of you are wanting to release a burden, wanting to be free, 
um, or maybe take a break from a relationship at the moment, or it could be your partner. Why is the Ten of Wands here for Sagittarius? Yeah. Some of you could be burdened by, feel burdened by the family situation. Or it could be some of you are wanting to release someone who you don't see yourself having a family with. Okay. Why is it the pentacles here? Three of Pentacles for Sagittarius. The Devil, twice. There's things to be worked on in this relationship. There could be addictions. It could be that you're, you could be burdened by your partner's addictions for some of you. That could be why you're wanting to release this burden or at least work on it. Maybe they don't want to get help and you're trying why is the devil here twice why is it here that's how Sagittarius sees them ten of wands again definitely a burdening situation wanting to release a burden I do feel like it has something to do something to do with addiction with the devil here twice and the ten of wands here twice one is in reverse so some of you have released a burden some of you are wanting to release a burden okay What's, why is the <clears throat> eight of swords here Sagittarius stay oblivious to what's going on I do, I do feel like those of you who are dealing with someone with an addiction they don't want to it's like they they have the help they have your support or their family support and they are just they don't want that they, they're, they're, they're rejecting the help Whatever kind of addiction it is, they're rejecting the help. Um, whatever problem they have in the relationship, they're rejecting the the offer to fix things. If you're offering to, to mend the relationship, they're they're rejecting that. Why is the Ace of Wands here? Again, could be an alcohol addiction, but. Um, could be alcohol addiction. They could, they could um, offer to, <clears throat> to, to accept the help, or they could offer to. Eventually, start to work on the relationship, like accept the fact that you want to work on it, and work with you, eventually. Work on the relationship. So let's have cups here for Sagittarius. They don't want to leave. They don't want the relationship to end. They see you as their partner. It could be vice versa. This could be you not wanting to leave. It could be you with the, the addiction. But the main story here is this person has the addiction. This is their side. So. Whoever this is, they don't want to leave. They don't want to lose their family, but they are struggling with, they're struggling, like as much as you're struggling to make this work, they're struggling with what is holding onto them, like this devil card. Why is the page of um, pentacles here? Pentacles. 
situation is unsettling for some of you. This person needs to set boundaries in their life, or someone needs to set boundaries in their life, but they're not, and it's just unsettled. Maybe they're slightly immature, they need to mature. Maybe they need to be, you know, more more willing to make sacrifices for the family or for the person they love. Why is the Six of Wands here for Sagittarius? Let's clarify the outcome. you who have been left out in the cold you're coming out of the cold with um, this is aside from all of this if the rest of this doesn't resonate with you and you've been cut off <clears throat> you will be coming out of the cold with someone and being in the six of wands energy so contact is coming in for those of you who are waiting for contact now back to the story this person may may um, accept your help may may agree to help work on the relationship, do what they need to do. They'll eventually do what they need to do, but it's because you're leaving, it's because you're on your way out the door, or whoever is on their way out the door, the other person is about to, or at least wants to try to work with you. to fix things. So the six of wands is a great outcome for Sagittarius. It's a good outcome. It's like some of you may be leaving this person or the person will come around and cooperate. Someone's gonna, you are gonna come out on top regardless of the situation, okay? So what do we have for Sagittarius? Release your ex. Some of you are releasing this person. Especially if you're not married. If you're just dating this person, it may be easier to let go of that type. If those of you who are married, it may be more difficult, obviously. <clears throat> Forgiving and learning as you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moment. safe for you to love, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all, honeymoon enjoy the bliss of holiday time together, okay I do I did just get the vibe that um, you guys may be putting, if you're, if you're married and living with this person, you may be putting aside the, the chaos, the drama the, you know this um, disagreements for the holidays, maybe for just Halloween or for both Halloween and Christmas, Thanksgiving. The holidays are coming. Some of you may be putting this aside for now. And maybe, maybe for some of you, it's after the holidays that this person decides to cooperate. We'll see. What advice do we have for Sagittarius? Unconditional love, love yourself and others. And every situation, no matter what the outward appearance may be. So those of you dealing with someone who has an addiction or you know an issue, 
it's trying to like open you up to not see it as such a burden but you know obviously you care because you're here or you're still with them but love unconditionally basically you know inner wisdom you know what to do trust your inner wisdom and take appropriate action without delay some of you may have no choice but to leave some of you may still stay and fight whatever you choose to do this is your outcome the six of wands so you'll be making the right choice only you know what to do Passion. Release judgment about yourself and others and focus on the love and light within everyone. So you have two cards here that tell you to love someone regardless of what they, of their outward appearance or what they, what it looks like on the outside. So just keep that in mind. Focus intention. Keep your unwavering thoughts feelings and actions focus on your target and you will make your mark those of you who are focused and determined to help someone go for it some of you uh, are fed up and are leaving i do feel like those people are the people who are just dating someone like this In the married couples i feel like you guys are going to stay for the fight stay and and work on it fight through it But yeah, either way, the outcome is gonna be great for you. Whatever you choose to do. So just keep that in mind, okay? So uh, Sagittarius, that was your reading for mid-October. Check your moon, Venus, and rising. If these messages didn't resonate with you or if you'd like more insight on your month and the competition, is going on like subscribe and comment whether you'd like to win the gilded tarot or the arcanum deck which is that one these ones okay so i hope you enjoyed thanks for your amazing comments and likes and subscriptions and thank you for watching